Hello and welcome. So I'm going to be making my thankful journal. So I have something to be writing in in November. So hello and welcome. I see Tommy, Karen, Kathy D, Terry, and Darlene was leaving. So hello to all of you. And um, so I did print out the Patreon October kit because that's what I'm going to use for this. So the Opals, they got these two pages. You saw we made the zine out of that page yesterday. And then this page. And then my computer, my printer went a little wonky. And so, but I like it. So the next, the pages that I printed, so I just was like, okay, I'll just print the pages. I love it with the lines in it. So I, I scanned it and um, so I will probably put the scanned ones in Patreon um, next month, maybe. Um, but no matter what, I'll be using this, the, the ones with the lines in them because my printer did that and so... Um, this is the Ruby kit. So the Rubies get a small digital kit. I showed you a few pages yesterday. So you can see you get the large print and the, the various sizes. You get the six pack also has the lines in it. So I'm going to be using that. This page ended up with the lines in it. Hi, Regina. Hi, Big Mama. Hi, Kathy. Hi, Andrea. The postcard page ended up with the lines in it. Happy Halloween. Um, this one didn't really have the lines in it, but I'm going to be, like I said, I'm going to be using these. Was there another? There was another one, right? I want all the lined pages because that's what I'm going to use for in the base of what I'm making. Okay, so this is the what the diamonds got. They got this ephemera page, this ephemera page with the large tags, and they got a, they got a okay. Theirs don't have lines unless their printer does this. So and then the emeralds got these two pages. Okay, again without the lines. So, so these are the pages that I am going to use. Hi, Janine. Welcome. Hi, Chrissy. Um, you, usually they're exclusive to the, um, to the Patreon. I mean, it is very special that they subscribe and they they pay my bills. <laughs> they make it so that I can be here. So that is their special um, kit for October. Um, we've been doing three years. So that means that each level has 36 of whatever it is that they were supposed to get at that time. <laughs> so there's a there's a lot of there's a lot of kits, a lot of digitals in there. Um, I'm also going to use the emerald kit, um, but since theirs are theirs are still in the mail, I'm not going to work with that today. Um, but there's also a little thing. Uh, where is it? Uh, a a doodad kit. So it's got like eyelets and sequins and buttons and. A leaf charm and some other things some beads um, that we'll be using so um, so this was the emerald kit and I'll put that up there so today I am going to be making the pages for this now another thing that I did and the patreons they get when I I'm gonna make something because I want it um, they get it too and now this was their subscription kit 
Remember, they got the dandelion kit. That was extra this month. Oh, I did print out the hummingbird kit. And if you want me to, I'll show it to you later. Um, but it, there it is. The whole woodland hummingbird kit. So the other thing that I did was, do you remember when I did the the gel prints, um, I went ahead and I've got some of those. So these I will have for in my kit. I love these. These I'm framing and they're going on my wall. The other ones, I have the originals and I'm going to use those for tags and things in this journal. So trying to, you know, use up the things that are hanging around. The other thing that I'm going to be using is one of my envelopes from Big Mama. And I'm going to, it's going to have to get cut down and I'm going to cut it down and re-sew it. I'm probably going to just use one ply of it. Um, but that is going to be my cover. I think that that will be really cool. I'll show you some other things that I have saved. And um, so some of these are from um, Daphne's Diary. So I can't sell anything that I make using Daphne's Diary, but I can use it for myself. And I think these colors are going to be perfect. And I've been saving them for um, to make something for myself. And so I think the colors are amazing for this. And look at using leaves and then drawing with them. That's so cool. Mushroom soup. But I think these are going to be um, perfect colors. Then there's these, and I think I'm going to use these for, like, pockets. Even though the one says, Hello, October. <laughs> okay. So, cute little bird down here. Maybe I'll probably cut the dragonfly out and put that with my dragonfly stuff. Yeah, those of you that are working on your challenge, they're they're wishing you um, good luck there. Okay, so this is from a long time ago, 2017. So, um, yeah, so I wanted to use those things. So those are those are the pages that I have. I'm gonna go ahead and fold this and put it together. I will be cutting the white lines off. Um, and so I'm going to just do a regular nine by six journal, but I am going to make it two signatures and I'm going to make the spine as big as that, um, that thing is going to let me, um, let's see, do I want to, uh, I'm going to go ahead and... And I'm going to be okay with white pages. I can stencil and add things in to the white pages. Because of the way that my printer was working, I was afraid. To, I was like, oh, good, I got a print. I was afraid to print on the other side. Because I didn't want the print to ruin both sides. So I love this. I love that. Okay, so this is a pocket page. I mean, it's postcards, but I'm going to use it as a pocket page. Again, my printer did this striping thing, and I, I really think it's cool. So I'll probably put that stripe, because I did scan the striped pages because I thought they were so cool. And so those will go into the Patreon also. 
Okay. So, um, the Patreon at the $10 level, you will get this full kit, except for the big pages. Um, these last two pages, those are, I'll show you, the last three pages are emerald and diamond. The emeralds get everything. Topaz, um, let's see, Pearl gets everything and a flow journal. And Topaz gets everything that the emeralds get, and they get a two signature um, hardcover journal. This is the kit, the October kit that the um, Patreons received. So, so it's in there. Okay, so this is a six pack and it is done so that you can fold it up. Okay, I will be cutting the white pieces off. I'm gonna go through and cut all the things after. Okay, we'll come back to this. That's a sapphire, which is the $5 level they got that one okay so this one I I don't remember who got this one I have they're all out of order now I love that I think that will be the when you open the the journal I think that's what we're gonna have you see I love this Okay, so there's that one. And then the emeralds, which is the $25 level, they get these. They get other stuff, and they get that um, physical kit that I'll be using um, to make my embellishments and things during the 30 days of November. Thankful. I love this. <laughs> it's like, okay, it was an accident. I love it. Okay. Now, okay. trying to think if I if I should just go ahead and fold this and use those as pockets and then have a another another pocket I think so that'll give me a little okay oh physical the emerald song <laughs> I have friends going to see Wicked, and and so it's been really funny because the Wicked um, stuff has all been to the songs from the Broadway play and from the others has been showing up in my um, in my stuff. It's been so cool. Okay, I think this is a pocket, and this is a pocket, and then this. No, we'll go pocket pocket tag because this has something going on at the top okay so um yeah so sapphire this is something that you can do with your well any of you um if you have a large tag in your the digital that you're using this is something you can do okay so we're going to go ahead and fold this over. This just gives you a better well, it's not straight. <laughs> there. We'll sort of straighten it out. I have a headache. Oh my gosh, and I have to go to town because I bought a um, 
I bought a file cabinet and I have to go pick it up because they move out of their building today. <laughs> Oops. I don't even know where I'm going to put it. But I needed a bigger file cabinet for all my um, paper, my kits. <laughs> okay, so there we went ahead and we put that one down. I think we'll go ahead and put this one down too. Now one of these I'll make it big and one of these I'll probably make it a double edge pocket. So I do have the do the thing. I did um, go through and do that. Um, so we'll have that join. And if we get 35 thumbs, I'll give away a digital. So. So Tom goes, he's leaving for work. He goes, we're, um, we're carving pumpkins tonight, right? I'm like, uh, mm, yeah, I guess we're going to the pumpkin patch, which is in our backyard. Because, you know, I grew 10 pumpkins. So. I'm out. I'm, well, I thought I was out of ink. And I went and picked up all the printer ink cartridges and went, okay, we're going to. I turned off the printer and turned it back on, turned off the computer, turned it back on. And the heavy ink one that I put in there, it says, um, what did it say? Uh, something like, you have used this one before or something like that. I was like, yeah, but I want to use it again. <laughs> I, want it, I want it to work. So I'm going to go ahead and chop these off. Because I'm making my cover so my cover can be to the size of my paper. Hi, Carolyn. Oh, yeah. So my grandson, the one that just moved out, he and his roommate were in a car accident this morning. And I don't know. They're They're okay. They um, were on their way to work, and so they, the, the police officer took them home because their car was not going to make it home. But, so he would, the paramedics checked him out, and he uh, didn't want to go to the hospital. So praying that everything really is okay cuz you know car accidents can be can be funny. Well, not funny, but they can be different than what you think they are. Okay, I'm going to make this the double one cuz it's going to be on the right-hand side. And so I'm going to go ahead and squiggle some glue that'll help hold it closed okay and I'm gonna hold this up and put this in and I might have to cut edges and that's okay thank you so I can go back and stencil if I want to I really just want to have the journal set up. Oh, look at that. Julie, Julie, Julie. I did that. I did that. I messed that up. So we could go ahead and um, I'm not going to take it off. Okay. So um, I'm going to clean up this edge though. So you could go ahead and leave this so that it's a little um, flap, and I think I will. I think I'm going to leave it as a flap, 
And um, if I decide I want to put it down, I can, but I like having this one and it'll have two places and I can grab a um, Project Life card and put it in those. That'll be, I think that'll be cool. Got to, it, it just, it just happens to be right here. <laughs> okay, so that's my first page set up. And the, the digital page on this side is from my gel print. And so, I'm, like I said, I'm trying to decide if I'm going to go ahead and put those in the... I think we'll cut this just because... There we go. You had a lot with special needs, a lot of trick-or-treaters. Oh, that reminds me, I have to find my pencils. I have pencils. I did not go out to the big box. Okay, so there, there's one. One, one and done, one done. Okay, now I have this one. And of course, it could be a gigantic belly band, but I'm thinking this is going to make a great tag. So I'm going to put this to the side. And let's see. I have... Okay, so I have this paper. Oh gosh, this, this, um, okay. It's got a leaf on here that is going to come off. Look at the cotton. Okay, how do I want to do this? Okay, it has that leaf. Where's the, where's the owl? The owl is down here by the leaf. You know what? There was a picture of what you were supposed to do, right? In here somewhere. Okay, here's some squirrels. Here's a squirrel page. I think we can make this this one have pockets. Okay. Okay. And it's pretty bright. Okay, so that'll give me that, and then I can make that to go in there, maybe. Okay, but that gives me another page. Okay, so for, a, for double page spreads, we need 15 papers. Um, for single, you need like between seven and eight. Okay, here's the here's the picture of what it's supposed to look like. So the leaf is supposed to be open. You take it off and hang it with the card on a piece of string. That's what they've they've got us doing. Um, well, it could just be a page. 
because what I was going to do when I realized that that was there, I was going to pop this up and this was going to be my, my page. I think what I'll do is I think I'm going to go ahead and cut this. Okay. I'm going to cut it here. And it's nice and thick. Um, Chrissy, I'm making my journal that I make every November so that I have a thankful um, journal. I have something to write what I'm grateful for each day in November to get ready for the Christmas season. It's something I have done for many, many years. And so, oh, look at, we've got this cute mushroom. I think we'll, okay, where's my page? Sorry about that. Okay. And I have these pages that I've been saving to use. And so it ends up that the colors are perfect. So that gives me three pages so far. And then this, I'm gonna go ahead and pop this out because I, I figure that it's gonna end up popped out anyway. And I can use it somewhere in my journal. Okay. And I'm, okay, so. What if that is on that page? And our little owl is on this page. Um, it's gonna be, uh, are you talking to me, Regina? This journal is gonna probably be the nine by six size um, except that I'm gonna cut my edges so it'll it can be a little smaller I'm using that um, giant envelope from Big Mama for the cover and I'm gonna use the whole thing so it's gonna probably get to have like a, a one and a half to two inch bat binding I know that one of the things is I always end up needing more space with these um, these journals so let's go ahead. So I'm using the, um, in case you just came in, I'm using the Patreon October Digital. I'm using the pages from um, all the different levels because remember each tier has their own thing. And then I'll be using the embellishments to make, make things um, each day to cut, to decorate the inside and to, um, to put what I'm grateful for. And I think this is going to be a really good exercise for me this year. I'm kind of melancholy-ish. And so I think I, I think I kind of need this. <laughs> okay. So there, that can go there. Um, for right now, I, I might decide to put it somewhere else. Okay, what about here? Yeah, I like that better. Okay, I like it better on the big pink and, and put the color over here. Yeah, I was thinking about that. I was thinking that might be kind of fun. So we'll see. But that gives me two more pages and I'll keep them together. So the lines happened because of my printer, okay? So <laughs> just a, just an FYI there. Um, oh my gosh, I love this page. Um, I think it'll be okay. Oh, what if we, we use this to back another page? Okay. Um, Yeah, well, the thing is, is I'll be using the emerald kit 
and you guys are ahead of me. I've got um, sequins in there. <laughs> it's like, okay. <laughs> yep. And because one of my favorite things that I love about fall is when the leaves swirl like a little mini um, dust devil thingy, but it's just leaves. That's, that's like one of my favorite things. So, um, okay. So I'm thinking, let's see. Yeah, I think, it, I think the blue edges will be okay. I'm going to go ahead and pull this in a little bit again, because I'm going to make a couple of big pockets. Bye, Bonnie. Oh, awesome. Your instant ink is here. That's, that's so cool. <laughs> Mine, <laughs> the other day, I'm like looking at the mail and Tom's like, are you looking for glue? <laughs> he hates when I'm looking for glue because... It's not like where we live. You can't just go to the store and get it. Or he would. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to go ahead and glue these. Now, I, a lot of the time, will put pictures in these. Um... And make it like a keepsake album when I do them. So, okay. So, um, I definitely want that side. Because it's beautiful. So, we're going to go through and figure out where we cut this other one. And remember, we get to cut it down. So, we'll just cut it right here on that edge. Putting my leaf over there. Hopefully I don't forget it. Okay. Um, so um oh I've got a I've got the wrong the wrong goodie there. Okay, I think we can go ahead and fold this in half and then I need to cut Cut one side. So they're out of a Daphne's Diary magazine. And as we all know, you are not to, they don't want you using their stuff in things that you sell. So I've been saving this to be able to use it in something for myself. So I'm very very excited to have finally have something to use this for okay so we'll go ahead and lay that right you know what go ahead and put glue down the middle put this in because the last one moved, so I don't want it to move. <laughs> How are you using so much glue? <laughs> well, I'll tell you, I'm on, I'm going, um, I have to go pick up that file cabinet, and I have my order at Michael's, and it is glue. Um... Because it was not, it was a good sale, so okay. So I'm gonna do that, and then I'm gonna come over here. I'm gonna fold this side down. You know what? What if? Okay. Yeah, I think we're gonna make this one a from the top pocket instead of from the side, and then I can get rid of that. 
Yeah, I like that. It's my prerogative. I can change my mind. Okay. Okay, so that gives me another page set. I love how eclectic this is. <laughs> I mean, I really, really like it. You know, there is a paper pad that my mom had in her stuff that might go with this that has glitter. I'll have to see if it, that would be, be awesome to be able to use that. Okay, so I have a big, huge side pocket here and a big, huge top pocket here. And I'm going to go ahead and we'll put the, put the dealy bobber. Okay, so there, got one, one at the top, one on the side, and let's come back over to, okay, wait a minute, got that, got that, got the pocket, oh, this one, okay, so this one's double, so... We'll go ahead and put our little dilly in there. Sure we will. So did anybody else carve pumpkins or are you? <laughs> we we um we color Easter eggs too, you guys. <laughs> and we leave we leave cookies out for Santa. <laughs> okay, so we've got our double edge pocket here. Oh, look, 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 look. Compromise. Okay, so double edge pocket. We've got this little flippy thing that can turn into something else. Large pocket here large pocket up here this has um two pockets look at those squirrels isn't that adorable and then this is our our leaf and our owl and so we're going to want to do something to the inside of that and this is our giant mushroom i think we'll put him in front of this Wow, that's a lot of double-sided tape. Okay, so we want to do something with the inside. So we've got one, two, three, four so far. Okay, let's get into the... Remember these? And I think... I think this should go in as a page or, or two little pages. That's what, that's what we'll do. We'll do two little pages. They're, they're the, just the right size. And then I'll have this to use, um, use for something. This is pretty heavy duty paper right here. But look at, I'll have that. Woohoo!
I think we're going to go to um, the Sororo. There's no, there's a G, but it's silent. Sororo <laughs> um, National Park this weekend. I'll go and see that before the kids move. Yeah, so I'm thinking of putting two of these in there. They can be like little flippies. I'll put them opposite each other. How does that sound? Do I have a planner journal? Um, right now, I do not. I, I have an amazing planner. Um myself if, if you were asking me I don't know if you're asking me but um yeah so there's all those pieces I'll be able to use those and so what I'm thinking okay okay We'll go ahead and we're going to, we want to keep, keep those words. So we're going to do that. And then, yeah, I can go to his tail. And there's a cute little butterfly there. And that will give me that. And I think what I'm going to do is um, I may not do it like in order. I may just pick a place like I do with. Um... Oh, Tommy. <laughs> you were asking Tommy. I, you guys, I found the perfect planner for me. I like it so much that I, I ordered the same planner planner I ordered the same style for next year it just um because more of what I do is all of this needs to be done this week and then I put down and I need to see the whole week and so they're I, I can't remember if it's their classic style it's their big block um happy planner is what I what I got and um okay so then this way we'll go i think we can just oh my gosh that would make a cute pocket though and then that could go flip with it i don't i mean I messed up because I don't need October. But I could come over here and and get those. You know what? I'm going to just go ahead and put it. And if I decide to glue it down, I can glue it down. If I don't need it glued down, I won't. But these are going to go here okay oh if it's gonna do that it has to go in that direction right so this could be a flippy and then this could be a flippy and then you flip this and you flip that yeah I like that okay so that's what that page is getting and this one has the owl, and the back has the leaf. Okay, that gives us another page. Okay, now we've got this page. This is going to be the front page. So you know, um, a front page, I like to have a um, pocket in my, in my, inside my first page. And that's where I can put things that I'm 
saving or that I need to put in the journal. I don't necessarily want them in the inside cover. Whoops. <laughs> okay. So, yeah, so I'm using paper that has, um, it's just got the white back. So, um, I think, I think this one will be pretty because it kind of introduces what we're going to have going on. Okay. So these were supposed to be cards of some sort, or they could go around a jar if you were making something that was in a jar that you were going to give to people. Okay. Let's see. Yeah, they can go like that. And there's little scissors. So you know where to cut. <laughs> okay. I was looking for my lacy scissors. I'm going to use these. I was going to get out the punch, but I think this will work just, just fine. To just have a lacy edge. I'm really going to wish I had put a napkin on this page, I think. I still might, because I think I have an, another one. Yeah, I'm gonna put a, put a napkin in here. Okay, so there's that. I already trimmed this down, right? Yep. We'll go ahead and lay this over. I do a lot, a lot of lists on scraps of paper myself, and I have a really hard time finding a paper that I can allow myself to write on. But I also do do a lot of um, writing on... Ooh, that's kind of pretty. What if we do this? Can that, can that go and have that? What's on the other side? Oh, I'm gonna I don't wanna lose that dragonfly, but that's okay. Let's see. Let's see if that will if that will fit. Where's my my pocket? I could do it with the fluff. And the yayas. Okay. Okay, so we cut this. There's a dotted line right here, as a matter of fact. So we're going to cut it on the dotted line. Okay. And we're going to put this in up here. And we'll move. Well, let's see. If we go that way, and I want the I want the fluff. I like the fluff. Yeah. Okay. I love, um, I love my list journals and, and I love how, you know, well, you see, I use, I use them for things. Um, I have a, a journal that is, well, the one that we made for the, for the contests. I have one up here for, um, challenges. 
when I'm writing notes. And then also the list of who finished goes in that one. And um, then I have, well, then I have my couple of prayer journal things and stuff. But um, then I, us I usually have the one that I've written all my all my stuff, the goal thing that I do. And, and then I write in that and I just make my list in that. And then I have my holiday one that has how we made Christmas dinner last year and the gift list and all of the things are in that. And I use that one, this, the same one, I've used it for four or five years. And I'm gonna use it again this year. Okay, don't like that. Houston. Houston, we have a problem. We're going to have to re reconfigure it. I can do that. And that's what that kind of journal is for. It's just you know, a lot of times, some of the lists we don't need to keep, but some of them, it's like, oh, I, um, I wish I'd have kept that list because here it is. I'm doing it again. <laughs> okay. And we'll cut this. So, and of course, if you are a person that likes to distress, go ahead and distress all these things. I don't like to. <laughs> I'm not going to. Let's see. Oh, good idea. With a, a scrappy pad inside there. I guess I can't, that's what I kind of do because I have a scrappy, I have my scrappy stuff right there. Oh, look at that. I like it. I like it a lot. Okay, I put a little glue on the edge there because I'm like, okay, are we going to mess up again? So the decoration for this, the majority of the decoration will come from when I go through and embellish it for the days or for the, the things that I'm grateful for. Not necessarily days, but I am going to write in it all 30 days. And I like having pockets because sometimes like... I can. T I don't have to take this journal with me um, when we go away this weekend. I can take some tags and things that I can add in. Okay, so there, there's that. And then I have these edges that might get lace or they might get, like I've got this that I wanna use possibly in here somewhere. Um, I've got lace. Look at the, and look at this. That I think is going to be really, really cool on here. Okay, so that gives me another page. I think that those um, those are fine. I don't think they need anything, but that that gives me a, a nice finished page there. Let's see. Um, we have this one. Hi, Debbie. You're lurking, huh? Well, thank you for dropping in. You guys, make sure that you give this a thumbs up. And I don't know. 
with only 21 people watching, are we anywhere near 35 thumbs? Because we are live. Oh my gosh, I didn't even realize that with the, the way that the striping happened um, from my printer, that those were gonna, gonna match that well. That is cool. Okay. So this actually will make, probably make a nice tag. Oh, we've got the, the bird though. And I'm gonna wanna do something with the bird. Okay, going back to my papers over here. Have this beautiful paper. You can hang this page up as it is or put it in a nice photo frame. Isn't that pretty? And the other side has cinnamon bread. So um, spicy cinnamon bread. Huh. Okay. So what do we want to do here? I want to have their um, signature because... You know what? I'm going to cut it just just around the signature and around the outside. And I'm going to go see up here. It's like it's fabric or something. So I'm going to just... Cut along and rip at the same time, giving me that look like it looks on the edge of it. Which it, it does different than tearing it. Okay, I'll throw those away. Okay, so we can go up. Let's cut across. Okay, now I got rid of the, I, I just, um, it didn't look like something that I would make. So I went ahead and, and said goodbye to the, to that. Um, I'm thinking full page and then maybe a tip in. Okay. And then I can write and I can cover this with something. Okay, so coming down here. Congratulations, Regina. You're going to finish. Yay! So, and then I do have the woodland hummingbird here for us to check out um let's go ahead we're gonna put you like that Okay, so this page is down and is part of this page. 
okay? So it's on the, the music. And then this page will flip over and can be a, a flip, a tip-in. So I can put something here to, to hold it, but that gives us another set of pages. Like, should we put... No. Okay. So I had to count pages. I don't want to make too many. One, two, three, four. I'm going to count those as five, six, seven, eight, nine, and um, yeah, nine. Nine. So nine times four is 36. So that's enough if you're just um, making, making the journal. Okay, what do we got here? Oh, we've got these. I thought these were so cute. And I'm going to put them in there. But you know what? They could... They could be cards. Right? They could be like little... Little cards. We have 35, 35 thumbs. Well, that is, that is cool. Okay. So you see these two are kind of ripped and that's okay. And I'm going to go ahead and just, do these. And now I'm going to wish my, um, that one page was on the, the right-hand side instead of the left-hand side. You know what I'm talking about? But we do have... Okay, so we have this page. I definitely want these to go in, This these leaves. Okay, so that was um, gel plate. So we can go one, two, so they can go, they could go in a belly band. I don't, I just don't want to not be able to see them. Oh, what about plastic? Okay, so I'm going to save these because I can put these um, in plastic. Okay, so when I find a, a good plastic piece. Okay, so... Um, yeah, so we'll put these with the with the leaf and the tag. Okay. Okay, this is our our pocket um page. Oh yeah, where it went, it goes on one side and then um, flips on the other. Is that what you're talking about? Okay, so I've um, folded the one side down. This is the postcard page. This is in the Ruby kit or the Ruby part of the Patreon kit. And then we're going to pull this over and... I either want to go just a little bit further than that one. Okay, we're going to go on this side. Okay.
So this gives me another short. Now remember, this was my printer did that. But I of course, I um I scanned it cuz they were cool. I was doing that right before this started. Okay, so see, then we'll have that. And since this is for me, I'm going to go ahead. Well, I'm going to fold this over first. Glued on one side and bottom and wraps around to the other side. Oh, okay. Yeah, so they it would be a pocket on both sides. Okay. Well, we're going to wait for the for when I'm using them. I'm going to uh, that's how I'll See, yesterday we just folded things and put them together. Today we're actually going to get the pages ready. Yeah, I like that. Okay, so both sides are folded. This this one's a little taller. Okay, let's go ahead. Okay, so um, here, just let me finish one more one more pocket thing. Or one more page. So now these actually, these could go in here. Or will they fit in, will they fit in these? Yeah, I like that. So maybe a couple of these can go in these. Okay, but this one, the, they're going to have tags come up off the top because we already got the, we already did this to the top. So let's go ahead and put glue here on the shorter pocket and down here. Okay, we'll do this one. Okay, so this one was made out of the postcards, you guys. And the postcards for this were, um, one was upside down so that it, it would, I made it so that it could be a pocket in a journal like this, okay. Then we've got our, um, our whatchamacallit, <laughs> and we're going to go ahead and let's see. Okay, so this one's going to be the short, the short one. So we'll go ahead and line it up, put it in. And then I like to put my glue right on there. So who's still here? Who's still here? Oh my gosh, awesome, Kathleen. Your challenge journal sold. Very cool. Okay, so this one can come in and be in the center. This one can floof out. Okay, and the, the middle one will have a pocket on the top. 
Okay. Actually, let's go ahead and bring this one in also. <laughs> I was like, what are all the me's, duh? <laughs> Yay, look at you all still here. Bella says here-ish. Okay. Well, don't go away because we are going to give away a, a digital here in just just a minute. Okay. Um, let's see. We're going to go ahead and cut this one. To this. We'll cut right to that line. Okay. And we'll cut right at that fold. And we'll cut this side in. Okay. And then we'll come up. We're just making this look more finished. Okay. There's that. Okay. That is actually it's probably kaiser calling to remind me that tomorrow is squish day it's mammogram day tomorrow three o'clock okay there we go okay so that one and then these ones are going to be side ones. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and fold this a little bit. So we'll get a little bit of glue on there. And we'll come and fold this one. I just want some to help keep it where it goes. That seems to be, be helping. Oops, I forgot to close off the top. Oops, but that's okay. Okay, I'm gonna come along here and hold it. A yawning contest over the phone. And now I yawned. See what you did? <laughs> and how many others of you are now yawning because I yawned? Okay, so there we go. Okay, here we go. Look at there. Okay, so this is our six pack. We have that spot and that spot and then this middle spot up here. Okay, so that gives me another page. And so, um, okay, so you can go ahead and we, I'm, you're on your honor that we really do have um, 35 thumbs. <coughs> so we'll go ahead and we'll give away a one sheet. Okay, we'll go ahead and give, give not a one sheet. We're going to give away a digital, full digital. You get to pick it out in the Dear Julie Julie Etsy shop. If you are the winner, you will email me at dearjuliejulie at gmail.com. And so, um, so yeah, one more time. That'll be dearjuliejulie at gmail.com. And um, you go and you look, pick out the one that you want, and then email me. That's if you are the winner. Um, we are going to be picking 
um, everybody pick a number between 1 and 100. Make sure that you're the only one with that number um, because I'm only, I only give away one digital. And so today I'm going to show you our newest digital, which is the Woodland or the Hummingbird Woodland. Remember, we had the Hummingbird Fancy um, last week. That's the one that has the purple. Um, where I don't know where it went. But anyway, so this is the, the Woodland one. And um, yeah, so pick a number between 1 and 100. No chatting. So we don't lose the numbers. We lost the numbers last week. So please, no chatting. And if um, I'll be going ahead and um, going to all chat, which will give me everybody in YouTube order. So, um, so give you, we'll give you a look at what's in this kit. So you have these large cards. I thought this would be cool for like the large file cards. And then we have, we we'll better turn these over. These are the originals, but smaller. <laughs> and these are from the mini journal kit. Here you have a six pack. And you're going to see a lot of the same, the same images, but in different um, ways so that you can use them. These three are from the um, hummingbirds around the world. I believe there's seven files of those. You have the wallet size here, and then you have the landscape wallet. Okay, so make sure you put a number in between one and 100. Closest without going over is going to, um, to win a digital. So this is the smaller of the six pack, the six pack and the two wallets. And then even smaller. Okay, I did the large envelope again and then with the um, ephemera over here and then I did it three more sizes. I love the little tiny envelope. They're so much fun to use in a, in a journal. So next I have the postcards. Okay, so, um, and you just saw me using a postcard, so this one will work just like that one did. You can go ahead and fold it up and have a small, small, pa small pocket page. Um, this one, you can fold it up and you can have writing space. Okay, this is the actual postcards that I had. I have I have two of each of those in my in my collection. And this is the actual size of those large cards and another one that I had and then the small ones. And you saw those ones in the other the other kit. So then I have there's tags. And we'll just go through these. There's um, several. I think there's I think there's 12 or 10. You've got the uh, from a, the hummingbirds from around the world. Some of those. I love this image. I collected hummingbird stuff for the longest time. And here's your small one. So there must be eight. Here's your small, small tags. And then, of course, you have side-by-side -side pages. So if you're making a regular size journal... Or you want to print these and make a, uh, something for the wall. Got two here. Here. And the music is the harmony music. And they are a couple different pages. Okay, we're almost done, you guys. There's the babies, and there there's babies on all the different sizes, but that is the full page with the little babies. 
Oh my gosh. There's the cat page. And there's the cat page on the collage page. There's the collage page. So this kit is available now in the Dear Julie Julie Etsy shop. And today is the last day that the hummingbirds and the purple kits are on sale for 40% off along with their companions. This one is ready to be a zine. Okay, so you can use it for journaling cards or a zine. This one also is ready to be a zine. So if you're wondering what the heck that is, we, we did those yesterday. We did three of them. So you've got your collage page and your cat page smaller and some more envelopes, okay? So it's over 40 pages of, we're calling that one Hummingbird Woodland because the colors were more like the woodland colors. And so everybody got their number in. So remember, if you are a winner, you are going to email me at dearjuliejulie at gmail.com with your choice. Don't message me in Etsy. You email me. Because <laughs> if I miss your Etsy message, <laughs> I get I get dinged. So, um, yeah. Okay, so let's go ahead and talk to Siri. Siri, please pick a number between 1 and 100. The answer is 56. Thank you. That's a different Siri. Her, lo her voice is very low. Did anybody else notice that? The answer is 56. Oh, look at that was 54. <laughs> um, okay, we're going to go ahead and make sure that we're on all messages. And so we'll go, wow, not very many of you. There's, uh, wow. Okay, we have 35 thumbs. And our number is 56. We have a 48. We have a 52. Gail, congratulations, Gail. So Gail will be our winner. For a digital. And that is 1031. Okay, Gail, so today is 1031. Make sure you put winner, winner in the subject. And congratulations. Okay, we're going to go ahead and finish just a couple more pages here, you guys. Because I really wanted to have the pages done. And um, so let's see what these are the those that I have left. Okay. Okay, I think. I can I can save that. I might be able to use that for um, something. Mushroom soup. Ingredients for two people. Oh, I think was I supposed to make? I think I was supposed to make mushroom soup. Sorry about that, you guys. Um, okay, this one is an envelope, and apparently it has. Um, You color this page in with colors that you like and then cut into an envelope. Um, I don't think I need an envelope, so I'm going to go ahead and make this a page in the journal. You know what? Let's go ahead. Let's, uh, let's rip it. I love that these pages are going to match so well. And then I have, there were stickers in this, this particular time. I don't think I need an envelope. Uh, I don't need a pocket either, I don't think. So 
We'll just cut this out, but that could be a tag right there or the back of a tag. Yeah, so we'll put that over with our tag stuff. And look, because look at there was leaves on the other side. So this is double sided. That's awesome. And if we just do it pretty much right in the middle, we'll have these two birds on this side and that bird on that side. And we'll have feathers that match match my journal really well, actually. Okay. Then we have, this is a day in the life. I love this. So she took the stickers and she put them on the wall. I, where did I put the stickers? These are the stickers that you get in the, so I'll put these over here with it because we'll use those. I might use the mushrooms though in my upcoming, um, but look at, I can talk about crafting here on this page. Congratulations again. Okay. Okay. I'm going to do that. Okay. Oh, you know what? I think I think I want the mushroom and the the bird to show up. Okay, so I have this, and I'm thinking I could put a top tuck here or, or a tuck of some sort. Now, remember, I said I wanted to use... So there's... Um, this is the original. And I want to use these in here. So I I like I like her. I think I can do um do something with this page. Okay. So this is the original right here. Okay. Okay, that'll give me a, a tuck spot. With her walking the dog. 
that would be me and Tom wishing that our that we could uh walk our dogs. Our dogs no. We we actually were laughing about that. Bye, Tommy. Okay. Okay, so that gives me that for that page. And then I'm gonna have that that I'm gonna be able to use in my, in my stuff. And I think this one can go on this page as a pocket. And then that can probably be a, a tag also maybe. So how to use your, all your trash, right? Magazine. Yeah, I saw this and I was like, oh, wow, her magazine has some gel plate that looks like mine. Duh. It, it is mine. Okay, that gives me another set of pages. And um, ah, toadstools. Oh, they're using doorknobs and putting doorknobs in the garden to be um, toadstools. I'm not gonna. I'm not going to use that. Okay, what do we have here? This is the cover. The covers are always cool. Oh, they don't, that, they're fish. <laughs> Chip, Chip can walk and all of his figured it out. Wiley has not figured it out yet. Wiley has not figured out how to, to be walked. So, okay. So I have just a few things left that we can, that we'll use. I'm not sure about this. I, I really want to, um, I really do want to put this in here. What if, okay, so. We could do it this way. Okay, so the hello. And it gets to be the biggest piece. Um, what if... What if I go around this like it's a doily? Oh, wow. And it's ripping so cool.
could go on the cover. Oh, look at <laughs> the little porcupine. I think he needs to go in the save it stuff. I don't think we need to save any of the rest of this. Except for the belongs to maybe. Okay, so I have the belongs to and I have the little porcupine. That might be my cover. This will go on the spine. We'll see. I can sew it on there and then it'll go where I want it to go. Or it could go and that could be the spine. Two inches. This is Like almost 15 inches so I I would have I could have a two inch spine so yeah 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 okay so I have this is going to be my cover this is probably going to be on my cover don't need the blue Oh, I still have one of these. So this is what I have to still put in. We're going to put these like this. I've got these three pages. They are going in. I just don't know how yet. Um, I have, I have uh, this. It's funny, it looks like a raccoon's tail over there. <laughs> and it's poppies. Poppies. Okay, so I have my little porcupine. I have the stickers. I have some scraps. This is um, actual gel plate that belongs to. I have the three little cards and I can go ahead and put lined paper inside those so that I can write in there. I think that that is... I think those are going to be really cool. Um, I have the leaf. I have a tag that was left from the kit. Hi, Carrie. It's a hedgehog. It looked like a porcupine. I thought he had porkies. I don't know. Probably is a hedgehog because that they are all the rage. So I could see her putting one in there, but he'll be really cute. He'll be. I have another one around here somewhere. Another one just hanging out. Okay, so these are the pages we did. Um, this, this, and then the crafty area there, and we have a top tuck and a pocket. This one is just the beautiful paper. We have our um, six pack with a little place here. And we're thinking that those, wherever they went to, those little cards, that's not one of the cards. Anyway, those cards will probably be able to fit inside here and inside here. And then we also have one that will have a tag in the top. 
we have the postcard page so a pocket here and a pocket here using the patreon digital and my printer did this with the lines and i love it i loved it so much that i um i scanned it <laughs> This is another page from the Daphne's Diary. I'll have a tip in here where I can write. And then there's that. And I'll be able to put maybe a flip here or something. But isn't that beautiful? Or it can just be, I might put a picture or something. There's another one of those striped pages. And here is this. And we've got two big pockets. There's the yayas there. And I used where this had um, come out of the, the center. I love, I love the fluff. I, I think it's really cool. Then we have the cute little owl and some woodland wreath here. Another one of the digital. And the two pieces that are probably going to be little flippies in here. You know, another page is going to go like this. So, so you'll go like this and you'll have this and this and, and this one might be a pocket. Um, I don't know yet, but so just give you an idea what's going on with that. And then the back is where the leaf came out. And so... We're talking maybe shaker pocket there because there is shaker stuff in the um, kit that they got. This was another page that was in the Daphne's Diary with the cute little squirrel. And this one with the mushrooms. And this was the bottom of the page that had the, um, the owls. And it's folded right there. That's bothering me. You know what? We'll go ahead and cut it with the fun scissors. Because, you know, if you've got fun scissors, you should be using them, right? Because it's fun to use fun scissors. And it was easier than looking for my punch. I was like, oh, I can just use the scissors instead of pulling out the fancy punch. There you go. I've got that. That edge happening. Okay. And then this one. And we did the double edge pocket. And here we've left this. It might be a pocket. It might be a flip. It depends on what I need when it's time to write in that area. And then I have this, and this has a large pocket on this side and a large pocket up here. So using the emerald piece, and then this was from the Daphne's Diary. This was um, one of the prints from the gel prints. This was from the Sapphire uh, Patreon digital. So that's actually two different ones. And I made a side by side. So I may go ahead and make a digital for the, the Patreons next month out of that and the lined. Um, let me know if you think that you guys would want that. I love the lines. I, I think they turned out really cool and really different especially the blue that one so yeah so then you know put this all together in some way shape or form I didn't count how many pages I have that's that's the other kind of important thing is how many pages do you have
I think I, I think I'm going to have enough. And again, we'll be using Big Mama's um, page or the that she sent me. Okay, so these are not cut down yet. That's a lot of pages. So some of the, these ones might be able to get put together. Okay. So just to give you an idea. Okay. How it's going to... This is not it, but... So it's eclectic. I love eclectic. I know. Can you believe it? Tomorrow is November. And look at how these match. <laughs> was not on purpose. I love this. This will be a tip-in. It'll have a lock on it. That page is, is stationary. It's down. Another pocket. Okay, so I didn't count. <laughs> I, forgot. I forgot I was counting. Okay, so we'll count real quick. One. Two. Three. Four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, counting those two as one, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Perfect. It's more than sixty pages. And so I can do two page spreads for each day if I decide to do days. Um so, yeah, so tomorrow morning I will be putting this together uh, so that I can use it. And then these are the things that I'll be using in it. This is going to be my 30 days of thankfulness journal. And again, I used the images from the Patreon digital kit. Okay, so these... Um, poppies and the dahlias are from and this that's all from that and then this is from my gel print and i i went ahead and i've made digitals out of the gel print um so yeah i love it i love the colors these are probably my favorite blend of colors right there so um, adding pink in with your fall. Well, this will be my cover. And I think it's going to be awesome. I even like, I, I'm even liking the grunge. <laughs> so um, yeah, so there's that. So don't forget, don't, don't forget. I'm not forgetting the, the do the thing. We're going to do the thing drawing here in just a moment. And um, let me put all these pieces up here. And so, yeah, so the do the do the thing drawing. Don't forget the hummingbird digitals and the companions are on sale in the Etsy shop. Today's the last day. They're 40 percent off. I can tell you the sale tomorrow will not be 40 percent off. Okay, and it will not be more. <laughs> so um, there you go. Okay, everybody. Um, let's see here. We had 76 people or 76 comments. And so that's what we'll be oh, excuse me, telling Siri. And so we'll do three. These are for one sheet digitals. There are 12 of them. And you get the one in the order that you have um, gotten them. 
Okay, so in the front here, you can see that Ashley and Bella have gotten all of them. Darlene is just missing one. And um, Sheila has eight. Or she's going to have eight. I got I have to send these. Um, and number 11 and number 12 have not been made yet. So, um, okay. So, let's go here. Siri, please pick a number between 1 and 76. It's 69. Sandra, congratulations. So we'll go back and we'll put those in and I'll have that done. Okay, Sandra, that was her number seven. Congratulations. Siri, please pick a number between one and 76. The answer is 27. Rondita, congratulations, Rhonda. Let's see, you're on here. Where? Where are you? There you are. So this is number four. Congratulations. And I can cross that off because I've written you both on the front. Okay. Siri, please pick a number between 1 and 76. That would be 36. 36 is Sandra again, and you can only win one on per time, so we get to pick another one. Siri, please pick another number between 1 and 76. It's 4. Ooh, we're going to go way up here. Janine. Chris, I think it's Janine, but Jay Christensen. I think it's Janine. Congratulations. And that might be, is that your first first win? Let's see. I don't see you. Go up slowly. Yep, I don't see you, so we'll put you in here. Congratulations. Oh, we've got one, one, one. And then we can go like that. And then we've got Gail here. So I go and I put Gail in the digitals, 1031 Gail. And I can cross her off there, and I can cross this whole page off, and I can put the paper clip back on. Dun, 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 dun. Something is finished, <laughs> sort of. <laughs> so congratulations to our winners, Jay Christensen. Oh, you're the, you're, that's you too? Okay. Okay, so, I'll put you those two together like that, and then I'll put a big one and then a big two like that. That's how I'll do that, because you're the same person. I think Mary has more than one name on here too, so congratulations, and um, yeah, so congratulations to our winners today. And, um, yeah, so are you going to be making yourself a little thankful journal? And it doesn't have to be as elaborate. I just really wanted, I loved these images, and I really wanted something that was my own um, using these. And I'm. it's going to be two signatures. I will be doing two, a two-signature journal um, because, maybe even three. Because I'm going to be adding things into it, and so it's going to fluff out, um, I'm going to have a soft spine on that. And so, um, yeah, so we'll probably actually put that together. You'll, um, I don't, I don't know that I can get it. I can do it tomorrow. We'll see. I, I, like I said, squishy tomorrow. And, um, and I've got to start getting ready for, for our trip. 
So, yeah. So, everybody, thank you so much for being here. Um, and I hope, I hope you enjoyed. And what did you think? I, I mean, I'm even using bad prints. So my, one of my favorite prayer journals had purple prints like this. There is a kit, the October, um, what it was that Excuse me. pink October kit is has lines in it and it's pinkish purple so yeah I think this is going to be really really cool so thank you for hanging out with me while I put that together um I want to congratulate all that have already finished their journals and cheer those on that are working on getting their challenge journals finished um so they can be at the vip which will be um it, it might be on my birthday <laughs> we won't be doing it on the the wednesday because that is the day before thanksgiving and i have company coming um but if i'm um so i've, I've got to figure out how we're going to do that so everybody, thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Find something to celebrate every day. Have an amazing day. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye-bye.